All right, guys, good morning. How's everybody doing today? So uh, we're going to be jumping in and uh, playing some a bit more of this uh, Metal Gear Rising uh, Revengeance Raiden's uh, story. We ha I had a bunch of fun playing it last time. I, I did listen to the playback. The music was quite loud um, at points. I turned it down a wee bit um, as we were playing, and then uh, I still, when I listened back to it, it was, it, it was still really, really loud, so... I'm going to actually turn it down. Uh, and I had it on three, and it was still crazy, crazy loud. Um, so we're going to kind of just turn a little bit of the sound down a tiny bit, guys. Just a tiny bit. All right. So we should be good with that, though. Um, let me see. So we're going we're gonna to crank this music back up. Let's see how loud it is. Much better. All right, but uh, yeah, last episode we uh, jumped in, got to the sewers, and then I believe that's it's where we right. ended. I'm yep. in the sewer system. All right, let's get started. Your mission's to investigate the Desperado-affiliated research center somewhere in that area. According to the intel from our client, the lab's been dumping illegal waste into those sewers. FYI, they're also involved with the cartels in human trafficking. Allegedly, anyway. <sighs> This just gets better and better. Tell me about it. We need you to infiltrate the lab and find out everything you can. Of course, you'll have to find it first. Some we big still ass don't sewers. know the exact location. So I'm looking for anywhere the lab might hook up with the sewers? Yep. If they're actually dumping waste, they've got to link up somehow. Find that connection, sneak into the lab, and see if you can find evidence implicating them on anything. No problem. Stealth's my specialty. Right. Well, we'll see. Do we have any idea what kind of research they're doing there? Not really. Maybe something related to all the people they're trafficking. Like experimentation? It's possible. First things first, though. Find a way into that lab. Oh, right. It says here the locals say black crocodiles live in those sewers. So, you know, uh, watch out. <laughs> black crocodiles? Could they be talking about UGs? Maybe just an urban legend. But still, be careful. Yeah, I, I will scout ahead. You will provide backup. <laughs> sir, yes, sir. Commence operation. Infinity Ghost A, all is well. Right. It's good to I'll see you. Unidentified UGs are patrolling the sewers. Exercise caution. So stealth is our specialty, right? Take out that UG quick. You want to attract too much attention down there. Damn, this thing is no joke. This thing is no joke, dude. Alright, so we're gonna have to just counter this thing. Both of its arms are weak.
So as soon as you see that that uh the limbs are blue, I think we could chop them off. <clears throat> that thing was putting the work on me, dude. Right, let's heal up. That thing was definitely working me. Hey, MC, what's going on? How you doing today? I see a maintenance catwalk. Use it to conceal yourself if necessary. Because, you know, stealth... You definitely don't want to fight another one of those things if we don't have to. I don't think I'm going to be able to make the jump, though, dude. Chat, could you imagine having to fight two of those? Messed up big time, guys. It's time to test out our. Uh... Wait, don't I have a? Uh... I thought I had a new weapon here. Yep, right here, the the pole arm. Bro, that is dumbass cheating, bro. You can't even dodge that, dude. It just like homes in at you. are fucking actually pretty tough. Let me heal. So I could cut the other one's arm off. Damn drop kick, dude. Oh, fuck. All because I couldn't make a jump. Right. There is a boy in 
in these sewers. So the uh, the blade or the the pole arm actually feels really really good. Yo, that drop kick is something crazy, man. It, they it never misses. Love the combination attacks. Yeah, it's definitely really good at AoE. I think the blade mode in this game is absolutely ridiculously fun. Like, I, I'm trying to think, has there been another game that really gives you like that blade just... Because Ghost of Tsushima is pretty good with swords, but this, the blade mode is, is really, really fun in this. I've never really seen a mechanic like it. Jersey definitely enjoying this one, man. No, we just did. We literally just did Sons of Force last night. Um, Siphon. We actually have no heals, man. So we cut that one's legs off.
Estás bien? What you say? Oh. Me a Guyanese from Guyana. You speak English? Uh, yeah. I'm from America. Call me Ryden. Me name George, like Georgetown. George. And just like all damn America president. Yeah. So what are you doing here? Me? What the rest of you do here? You lose the map of Ninja Hideout, Ninja Man? <laughs> no. I'm looking for bad guys. Our damn Skunter Research Lab. You know about it? Me know me now go back. Hey, you know one of them Skunt, nah? Nah, I guess you're all right. If you're a cyborg... What's he speaking? You know who Day is? Sort of. What happened to you? Oh, maybe you live on the street, raking scraper above, nah? Then this Kootenai dressed like the Mafia say, Hey, boy, you want a job? What well, the worst gonna happen, nah? But that mother scone don't put me on a rass boat. They pack us all a pickable doty container. Next thing we know, we're here at the zombie lab. All kids, like you? Yeah, a lot of boy. But then me been over here what them scone wanna do. Snuff us out. And got all day organ. So you ran. Uh-huh. It sounds Shame like pizza. That's what I thought. Robot but... ninja man. Same as you. <laughs> me been strongest cyborg ever. Warlock all them phantoms and black clothes that I pass me. Starting to sound like a bad guy yourself. Just playing, nah. Me done plenty bad thing. But me not kill no man. Nah, never. Good. We tried to warn the boy. I say. IOD's brain would get cut out. Run your ass out of there. But them boy with me no understand. They like Spanish or something. So me the only one for escape. Then that machine come after me and... And I know the rest. George, <laughs> I need every Damn, detail Ryden. about how you escaped. Oh. Daniel, from Ohio, how you doing, man? So the kid got into the sewers through a drainage channel? Yeah. He says the channel is super tight, but there's some kind of shutter next to it. Got it. That must be where they dump the waste. There's something else. It sounds like a Desperado exec was on site yesterday. If a Sentry Cyborg was on hand for the meeting... You should be able to review their video log, provided you can find a server access terminal. That would give us the evidence we need, as well as a little peek at the level of that technology. So what about the kid? I made sure the area was secure and told him to sit tight. Can you pick him up? Sure. I'll send a couple agents for him. You just focus on getting into that lab. If what he said is true about the organs, we need to hurry. Agreed. Right now. I'm doing good, man. Doing good. Heavy UG activity ahead. It is possible they are conducting test operations while the lab is closed. They're not going to make it easy to get into that lab. Is there some way you could sneak past? Of course, stealth is our specialty, chat. Can I go in the box? Yo, wouldn't that be funny if they actually gave right in the box, dude? No way. It's... How's that gonna help? Bro, are we really about to get the box yet? Oh, it's for medical supplies. That could work, actually. There it is, baby. No, it is not. No, it's not. It didn't work. What 
Don't underestimate the box, chat. G man with the five gifted. Thank you so much. Man, you guys won actually ham last night on them gifted memberships. That shit was crazy. You do like this. Get down here out of sight. This out, man. Fighting three of these dudes is gonna be a fucking nightmare, Jack and I already, I already know. Which, which Metal Gear game did they not have the box in? So I know they had it in 1 and 2. They had it in Snake Eater. They had it in Guns of the Patriots. And 5, I'm pretty sure. I feel like they always have the box. Is this guy really just going to... God damn it. The worst part about these dudes is that grab, man. Getting out of here. What happened? What is going on? Raiden, answer me! Raiden! Damn it! These dudes are the worst, man.
me out. Right. I have determined the approximate location of the lab based on the boys' information. It is marked on your Soliton radar. We just had a... We just had to really embrace the box, you know what I mean, chat? We just really had to embrace the box. It just wasn't boxing enough, you know what I mean? Hiding in a box? So lame. I forgot about this. Fake wall projection. Pretty well hidden, I gotta say. Pretty much a stealth master at, at this point. This would appear to be the UG maintenance area. You should find a terminal there. Something they use to upload mission parameters to the UGs. And something I can use to access the lab's main server? Perhaps. But first, you need to take a dump. I... wait, what? A dump? A digital optical output mounted proxy. You'll need one to interface with the terminal. Most any UG should suffice. A uh, tripod or the like. I'll see what I can come up with. How do I use it? Simply connect to it. You should be able to use your communications outlet to control the proxy UG. All right, let's give it a shot. Find the dwarf gecko.
Damn, that was big. Trying to split it to get the. Raiden, if they continue to increase security, they may shut out all outside network connections. Please do your best to avoid being seen. Bro, what was I supposed to do? It's not like they give you a whole lot of options here, man. box wasn't cutting it guys Now, yeah. But that room. Those were cyborg brain casings. Duh. We saw. George said they were harvesting organs from kids. Yes. This must be why they are trafficking children. Perhaps other organs are being sold elsewhere, but they are definitely taking their brains. Jesus. Are they making these kids into cyborgs? Wait. The cyborgs you've been fighting, did they seem like they might be kids? You said earlier that child soldiers have a telltale approach to combat. Yeah, but I didn't see it here. Those weren't kids. So, what? Desperado's just doing the surgeries there? We've got to do something about all those brains. And the other kids George was talking about. He just escaped a few hours ago. They couldn't have taken all their brains out that fast. True. There could still be a bunch of kids they haven't touched yet. I better move. God damn.
probably best you stay out of there. We don't want to risk harming any of the brains. What do you mean harming any of the brains, dude? Me hacking, that's cool. <laughs> Splendid! It is all ours. Now, use it to locate a data input terminal. These guys are pretty jumpy now. Any funny business, and they might just open fire. Try latching onto cyborgs' heads from behind. Then, an electric shock should knock them unconscious. I got him! I hit the wrong fucking button, dude. Dude, sure, just stomp the fuck out of me, guys. Yeah, that's cool. Just stomp me out right in the corner, yep. Really? Haha, <laughs> splendid! It is all ours! Now, use it to locate a data input terminal. These guys are pretty jumpy now. Any funny business, and they might just open fire. Try latching onto cyborgs' heads from behind. Then, an electric shock should knock them unconscious. We're in there, baby. Titan, I found something. In one of the Sentry Cyborg's visual locks. Guess who shows up? Patch it through. Right away. This big ass dude, man. Second one old Georgie boy used on the kids in Liberia. Of course, it's right straight to the brain now. Feels as real as anything else. Your work is astonishing. And your work is light. We need to sit before our cover is blown. We've got some assholes snooping around. We just do not have the food quantity yet. Each brain has its own unique requirements. It's not like we can just pop them out with an ice cream scoop. <laughs> All right. Make your point. Oh, <laughs> thank you for understanding. Say what you have now. I will destroy any unharvested inventory. Okay? But have you any idea what they cost? Last night, I checked. Children weren't exactly rare in the part of the world. Millions of them, in fact. You can get more once we set up a new lab. They lead lives of hunger and pain. We're performing a service here. For them and the cities they burden. But just gathering the donors required a significant investment. Yes, yes. Yes, you'll get the money. Accounting will be in touch. Gracias. I assure you we will dispose of our inventory the instant we can confirm payment. Are we done here? I've got a full slate today. 
Tecumse is a demanding mistress, and America has suffered long enough. Oh, yes, sir. Thank you, sir. Let me see you out. You see that, Kev? Imani's killer. Desperado's chief of operations goes by Sundowner, the Californian wildfire. The kids. Think we're too late? Only one way to find out. George was still alive. Maybe the payment hasn't come through yet. Hmm, maybe. But you heard what he said. They've already started some brains on VR training. There must be more than just what I found here. What about the VIP in the suit? I'll find out. He definitely seemed familiar. Right. I'm going after the kids. I dodged that robot by turning him into the box chat. We can't find George. What? Maybe the coordinates you sent us were off? No way. I merged the GPS location of our entry with all my movement data from that point on. This is bad. You think they got to him first? I don't know. I'll have our guys sweep the area. Thanks. I better keep moving. Christ. Walking the way. Push that thing back. Counter that. At least I'm not timing it good. Okay, you can. You can. 
the switch to biped mode. Careful, it is all new battle now. I just gotta learn this thing's attack pattern. This thing's attack pattern is absolutely ridiculous. It has switched to biped mode. Careful, it is whole new battle now.
There Price. it is. I knew I'd seen that guy before. Stephen Armstrong. As in Colorado Senator Stephen Armstrong. They're already talking about him as a shoe-in for the nomination in 2020. 2020? And get this. Two years ago, a federal grand jury investigated his ties to a certain private... World Marshal. The fuck did they the biggest think PMCs 2020 was going to look like? I remember. The biggest ever since the Big Five split up. Not to mention the single largest investor in military cyborg R&D in the world. Guess that answers the question of who's backing Desperado. Marshall and Desperado in bed together. <laughs> Should make for some fun headlines. More robot-y? Yeah. Headlines. This is World Marshal and a U.S. Senator we're talking about. <clears throat> there won't be any headlines. Even without the Patriots filter, no major media outlet will investigate allegations like these. It'd be financial and political suicide. So we just what? Sit back while they keep carving up kids, stand aside while they build an army of cyborgs? You heard them. We shut down one lab, they build another. They're planning something big, Kev. We can't just wait for it to happen. We need to hit them first and hit them hard where it counts. No, Raiden, no. I know what you're thinking and just no. Colorado is in America, and America has these things called laws. Mm-hmm. And law enforcement in Denver was privatized and farmed out to... Marshall, yes, so what? There are still laws, and it's their headquarters for Christ's sakes. You'd be heading right into the heart of a raging shitstorm. I didn't say it would be easy. We'll figure it out once the kids are safe. Jesus Christ! Kevin, out! Get a gaming co- oh, dude, I'm terrible at, like... A lot of the eSport types games are like shooters and shit, and I'm not that great at them. Like I said, we, what, we hear, what we do here, guys, is, is Class A mediocre gaming, all right? So much, dude. How you doing today? blood cryo preserver they must have begun preparatory freezing what do you mean that device is filled with synthetic blood plasma it can slow the metabolism of a harvested organ circulating this plasma to sustain oxygen levels you can preserve an arm a brain any body part for several hours so what are they freezing and why i could not say perhaps they plan to sell off the organs of the children they were told to dispose of unbelievable you had best hurry, Raiden. Right. Definitely cutting that doctor up if I get the chance. Greed! Thank you so much for the four months. I uh, sucked at it. We reached the final boss and never cleared it because it was too hard. So I just uh, watched the editing on YouTube. Was it really that bad, Greed? We had one fight already that was quite hard, man. That dog was ridiculous until I learned how to do the counter better. Hopefully they'll let me slice this doctor up in, into a bunch of pieces. What? Shit! It's caught right there! George! You've heard of chloroform? A potent anesthetic in smaller doses. But breathe too much of it? And adios, muchachos! Break that glass, and I'll blow his brains out! Ugh. 
Surrender or decide the needs of the many or the needs of the few. Right in. Don't worry about me now. Quiet, pendejo. <laughs> Surrender. I won't ask again. George, are you sure? Hmm? Hmm. I'm ready. Me life now so precious. Ting. What if we can take this scunt to hell with me? Cállate! <laughs> That's all I needed to hear. Stop it! Now! I'll kill him, I swear! Oh my oh uh. Did we kill George too? Siphon Core with the super chat. First super chat. Let's get it. Hey, thank you so much for that. I hope you're having a good day today. Yo, did we just kill George? There's no way we killed George, dude. He had the precision. He just cut the guy, right? He just cut the guy. He just cut the guy. He had to have. Ooh. How much do we have? I only got 81,000, dude. No, I think we can enhance the sword we have, though. Yep, here we go. So we can go strength. Wait, how much was it? Six. Okay, we can afford these. Really? Okay, it's starting to get a little expensive. So we enhanced our sword. Can we enhance our body, too? No. Um... Put some points into life here. Fuel cell enhancement. Skills. I think I might be able to, yeah, we'll enhance this. Oh, I don't have enough, damn it. Maybe. Yeah, 6,000, we're good. All right, so we enhanced the shit out of ourselves. Army Gal, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you for the gifted. Whoever receives that, welcome to the fam. Are we stateside now? Yeah, I'll definitely stateside. ...for his scheduled visit with Pakistani President Farooq Salam. The meeting is viewed as an attempt by the U.S. to strengthen relations amidst a surge of anti-American sentiment in the region. Yo, me ninja brother! George, He's alive! Good to see you up and about. How you feeling? Never brother, nah? No pain, no more fascar while them hunger space eat, and me never ever feel so awake, nah? That's because your blood sugar levels are being maintained automatically. Beats the hell out of coffee. Oh! Me been here you go while I got them scorn in the base. Why the rasa you not take me with you, huh? Damn it, Doc. 
Sorry, kid. You'd just be in the way. Aww. Besides, I thought she didn't want to be a killer, right? Me don't, but... Killing isn't fun in games. Wait, did we actually we slice him in half and that's a cyborg body now? Right. Wait, George, did we, act, did we actually slice George in... He didn't have a cyborg body before, did he? <laughs> that's all I needed to hear. It yearns to bathe in the blood of her enemies, but you hold it back. Yeah, just remember that. Sorry, Boris, it's done. Can't have a Maverick employee involved in a corporate raiding now, can we? You could at least come talk to me. No. It was time to break away from the old team, Boris. Past time. You cannot take on Marshall all by yourself. I won't sit by while they butcher little kids and ship their parts around like meat. It's sick. It's not all so simple, Ryder. They import those brains legally, for medical purposes. It's all done. Being legal doesn't make it right. Ryder, I... Hold that thought. Fuck you, Cyborg, you are not licensed to operate in this area. You're in violation of state and federal law. Guess you'd better arrest me then. <laughs> 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 Eighteen three one zero four point seven, threatening a peace officer. Deadly force is authorized. These dudes really trying us?
legs. <laughs> Just give up, dude. Don't make me do it to you, bro. Just... Bro, just give up. You got no arms in one leg, bro. This zone be designated for heightened security. I got him. Not dead yet. Your route through Denver has been plotted based on data culled from various security systems. I took the liberty of adding a guidance device to your chassis to ensure you do not stray too far. Handy, eh? Well, it wasn't as bad as I thought it was going to be fighting the two of them. 
Those ones were a bit weaker than that one that we fought. Probably because they're for civilian law enforcement compared to the military. Raiders, what's your status? They trashed my car. I'll have to go the rest of the way on foot. Do you really have to do this? Look, I'm fed up with all of it. Companies like ours, yours, bend the laws when it suits business. Why not bend it when it can save innocent lives? Raiden. Boris, listen to me. That VR training. They'll be warped into killing machines. They'll be set on POWs, civilians. It'll be one atrocity after another. Hmm. Like what you went through. We can't have any more Jack the Rippers. You saw what happened with George. I'm doing this, Boris. I have to. I can't save those kids from becoming cyborgs, but I can stop them from becoming murderers. Say you succeed. So you get all the brains back. Then what? Just so happens I know un great cybernetic surgeon. Doctor, but he cannot... You won't change my mind, Boris. This is my fight now. And your wife and son? What of them? They're in New Zealand. Safe. Rose would understand why I have to do this. <sighs> all right, damn you. You do realize Marshall has the contract for law enforcement throughout the city. They are the law in Denver. Yeah, we've met. Well then. <clears throat> Officially, Maverick Incorporated condemns you and your actions as unlawful. And a pain in the asshole. Now, increase your codec encryption. Do not worry about the lag. And unofficially? I'll do all I can over the codec to help. I do not like what those Mudaki are doing any more than you. Spasiba, Tavarish. Spasiba. We're in Denver now, baby. I kept trying to parry those roof. kicks. Traveling atop buildings will minimize enemy encounters. Um, then it wasn't working. I got him. Well, I wasn't. It wasn't working for me. <laughs>
Doc, what's your status? I am reviewing the pre-flight checklist now. I have hired contractors to handle shipping the brain units. We should be airborne in just a few minutes. You sure you can pilot that chopper by yourself? Right, and of course. Need I remind you that we live in the golden age of unmanned flight? Even manned helicopters possess a robust semi-automatic mode. It is simple, really. So simple that I can continue to monitor your status and world martial security from the pilot seat. I must say, for the world's largest PMC, their security procedures are quite poor. Quite poor. Sadly, I did not have the necessary permissions to override their plans. Nevertheless, the data I did find should prove most useful. So please, do feel free to contact me whenever you like. Appreciate it, Doc. Well, it's not every day one has the chance to collect so many brains. Think of the data! The research! Oh, and of course, your personal safety was a concern as well. Some support. Hmm? Not, not again. Just get over the fucking. Come on, dude. embedded in that hand. It appears that man underwent modification at the Patriot facility, just as you did. Ah! <laughs> 
thought I'd be able to freaking dodge that pretty easily, but... If their attack uh, glows red, it can be parried. If it glows yellow, it can't can't be parried. Best of dodge. So red is parryable, yellow is not. Out good chat. They're not high heels, chat. That's just how your foot has to be to be meta. That's the meta foot. It's both a hand and a foot. survived that and I could die 15 times falling off the building. This must be the railroad. It would appear so. Likely part of Denver's old system. 
This city was a major transport hub in the early years of freight trains. This particular line appears to have been abandoned some time ago. It was originally constructed to transport supplies to an underground factory. But now, it seems even the electrical system is no longer functioning. Yeah, it's pitch black in here. As a cyborg, I trust this is not a serious concern. Is there no way to just turn this on and keep it on?
dark as fuck in here, dude. Laid back with the super chat. Thank you, thank you. Slice and dice. We're trying. I keep getting drop kicked. Right. It would appear your only way forward is to return to the surface. You will exit into an evacuated commercial district. Security is heavy, but you need not worry about collateral damage when engaging the enemy. About time. Finally, I can cut loose. Proceed to the right from the exit. You will find a stairway on your right. Those stairs lead to a shortcut to World Marshal Headquarters. Do not be distracted by the advertisements. You are not here as a tourist. Sure. I'll just buy a quick souvenir or two for Rose and that'll be it. Raiden, we must hurry. Remind me to teach you about sarcasm sometime. I understand your attempts at humor. I simply do not find them entertaining. Man, this got shit on, dude. I mean, is Raiden really the... Like, I don't get the whole Jack the Ripper reference. I don't... Like, was that ever talked about in Metal Gear 2? Because... I don't get the whole Jack the Ripper thing. Anderson, brother, we're almost the one year. Happy Easter in advance, bro. I appreciate you, dude. How you doing today? Right. You have almost reached World Marshal Headquarters. in later in the game jack of the river thing and it's not doing good today brother. avoid fighting if you can
the next objective marker. Nothing suspicious here, chat. Yeah, I think that I I I, I'm, I gotta pay more attention to the attacks. I think I seen the yellow glow there, but also my parry timing is just trash anyway. So I, whether it's red or yellow, I still fucking miss it. Classified Patriot information was in that man's holographic memory. is a means to an end, to protect those you'd prey on. Really? Let me ask you, all those cyborgs you've killed up to now, maybe they weren't kids, but they were people. You ever think about them? When you're chopping them into hamburger? <laughs> they're adults. They made their choice. Sure they're adults. Sure they signed up for this. Right on the dotted line of their BMC contract. Usually, they're no strangers to war. In fact, many times they already lost a limb or two. Many times they were out of work and starving on the street. So yes, they sign up for surgery to fight God knows where. How else would you provide for your family when your country's embroiled in civil war? Pain receptors shut down, pumped full of fear-inhibiting nanomachines and sent right into the blender? Your blender? But they made their choice, right? Open your eye and see, Raiden. I've seen plenty. Then listen. Those battlefield emotions that the nanos suppress. Listen to them. 
What are you talking about? There he is! Kill him! Can we take him? What's wrong? The way he killed all the others? Oh God. Please God, don't let me die. Let's do this! I have a family! This isn't fair. Little punk. Listen closely now. Die! This is life! Now watch my wife and son die. This is all I have left. You ain't shit! Goddamn, I took my legs. <laughs> I needed a job. Stop! Help! I didn't know what I was signing up for. <laughs> Is something the matter, Raiden? <laughs> I'll cut the shit out of this, I don't give a fuck. Him, chat, but they left me no choice. Raiden, are you injured? I thought they had a choice. A fair choice. Not like you. People are different. As opposed to AIs? You're all the same, huh? You and your brothers. Manipulating mankind for our own good. It appears my statement has upset you. I apologize. <laughs> no, it's... I know you're right. As for AIs, we adapt as we learn. Just as any intellect operates, man or machine, altering the course of mankind is not among my divine directives. I guess that's a relief. Samuel's behavior does not match established parameters. You know him? Affirmative. We served together on three previous missions. He proved most capable. You think highly of him? I have always found him... dependable. Until now. Scouting data for the next area. I'll patrol ahead. You follow. Raiden, your current emotional state appears highly volatile. I am sure you do not intend to abort the mission, but I suggest you avoid combat for the time being.
motherfuckers tricked me. Only what I wanted to hear. When the war was over, they just threw me away. It's so bad right now. Dude. black and white now, is it? Is your cause just? Or is that just what you tell yourself? Fuck you! How pleased you are to chop away, Jack the Ripper. My name is Monsoon, of the Winds of Destruction. Yeah, I guessed as much. on the insides of your enemies? How easily you ignore the loss of life when it suits your convenience. So tell me, who saves the weak from the man who saves the weak? You're the ones exploiting them. You take advantage of their weakness. Of course they get hurt when you set them up as your human shield. Kill or be killed, Jack. Phnom Pen taught me that. Yes, you aren't the only one to grow up on the killing fields. War is a cruel parent, but an effective teacher. Its final lesson is carved deep in my psyche. That this world and all its people are diseased. Free will is a myth. Religion is a joke. We are all poor. Controlled by something greater. Means. The DNA of the soul. They shape our will. They are the culture. They are everything we pass on. Expose someone to anger long enough, they will learn to hate. They become a carrier. Envy, greed, despair. All means all passed along. How about full of shit? Is that a meme? You can't fight nature, Jack. Wind blows, rain falls, and the strong prey upon the weak. Ugh. Sam tells me you see your weapon as a tool. Something that saves lives, a means of justice. Now there's a pretty meme. Exquisite. It spared you the burden of all the lives you've taken. Absolved you of guilt when you enjoyed it. That is, until the illusion was broken. Don't be ashamed. It's only nature running its course. You have no choices to make, nothing to answer for. You can die with a clear conscience. You're right. About me, I mean. I knew something was off. After the Patriots, I thought I could walk off the battlefield and into a normal life. But here I am, surrounded by death, arguing philosophy with terrorists. I told myself this was about justice, about protecting the weak. But I was wrong. <laughs> then you admit it. 
I learned young that killing your enemies felt good. Really good. In America, my friends, my family, they helped me forget the devil inside. But who am I kidding? I was born to kill! <sighs> the bit about my sword, that means of justice stuff, I guess I needed something to keep the Ripper in check when I was knee-deep in bodies. Y you But you, all this, is a wake-up call to what I really believe. What I really am. What are you saying? I'm saying Jack is back. Doctor, turn off my pain inhibitors. What? This, this is madness. You do it. All right. Pain. This is why I fight. <laughs> This is my normal, my nature. You've lost your mind. Report back to the chief. He's mine. <laughs> You're the boss. I misjudged you. You are like us after all. Now you're just being nasty. <laughs> that nickname you love so much. Wanna know how I got it? Actually... Why don't I give you a demonstration? I think it's time for Jack to let her rip! Oh! <laughs> 
bit. This guy's actually got some juice. Oh, he's fast. from One Piece?
Terrifying true form. I'm strong. So your memes on here, dude. <laughs> Fine, Kevin. Relax. I'll get the brains. I don't want this for anyone else. All right, man. Later.
Tactical Psy? Oh, is that a new weapon we can use? It is indeed. We could try him out. Wonder if they're going to be any good. Can't afford either of those. They're good? I was hoping they were good. They look cool as shit. <laughs> you killed Monsoon. I'm impressed. Oh, so I could switch between them too. The brains are in the server room undergoing training. Knock yourself out. Go nuts. I'm sorry, sir. Our business hours for the day have ended. We are looking forward to your next visit. She's just an innocent civilian. If you do not comply, I will need to contact local law enforcement. Oh, she's not even. Watch out! They keep on coming! Bring me more, and maybe I can develop something interesting from it. Well, it doesn't have the same AoE potential as the other one, though. Yeah! <laughs> 
Poseidon. Sundowner contacted you from the top floor. Time to make your way up there. She snitched on us, chat. Plus, she was, she was just a robot. I still feel like this uh, pole arm is the goat, dude. The elevators appear to be disabled, which we should have expected, I suppose. I will access the control unit. Perhaps you can hack an elevator and make it operational. Ooh, splendid idea. By all means, yes. Hmm? It seems the guards are storming the building. Raiden, get back to the entrance. Buy me some time to get this elevator operational. Do not stray too far from the elevators, Raiden. Use the weapons around you to slow them down. Throw everything at them you can. You can control that UGT as well, yes? Give them hell! Yo, that pole arm and ripper mode is OP as shit. Did you guys see that? For security purposes, the building is divided into upper and lower halves. The lower area consists of offices and meeting space for staff and visitors, while confidential military projects and technical research are restricted to the upper levels. So that's where the brains in the server room will be, up top. Indeed. But that elevator can only access the lower floors. You need to get to the 20th floor and pass the security gate there to reach the upper area. Let me guess. Time to find another left hand? Well, that is the problem. Security cyborgs would not have sufficient clearance. But managers and senior staff have already been evacuated, no doubt. So... The only option is to cut the power to the security gate, which will not be easy. It is powered by no less than three systems, including a backup power supply. You will need to destroy all of the electrical control panels to disable them. In any case, you should arrive at the 20th floor soon. The electrical panels are most likely hidden in the walls. Use your enhanced AR to search for any unusual heat sources inside the walls there. Be an electrical panel nearby. Use your enhanced ah, they found you. No choice now. <laughs> Get off! <laughs> 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 
There should be an electrical panel nearby. Use your enhanced AR to locate it. Excellent! Just one more! They keep on coming! Yes, that should take care of security. Now, head back to the gate. We absolutely deleted those dudes in Ripper mode. Deleted them. Get him in there, guys. Raiden, shall I activate your pain inhibitors now? No, keep them off. I need it this way. Ah, uh, well, as you wish. I must say, I have turned more than a few men into cyborgs, but you... Well, your past is most... Uh... What you getting at, Doc? Most of the time, you're working with First World ex-military. Grown men. Compared to the average Third World child soldier, I can't really complain. Most of them, they're the sort of gorillas your typical patient gets paid to slaughter. Uh, perhaps, but, uh... This shouldn't be news to you, Doc. Uh, yes, yes, but, uh... Look, just help me take care of those brains after I bring them back. I do my business, you do yours. Uh, yes. They're pouring in from everywhere. This is crazy. <laughs> Do not have to fight every enemy you encounter, Raiden. Try and keep moving. Nice of them to blow open the door for me, yeah? <laughs> Idiots. I'm gonna go ahead and equip the RPGs. Ugh! <laughs> 
Christ, how long do these missiles follow you, dude? Something for this dude. in the area. Perhaps they could be put to use. Keep climbing like that. It will be much easier for you. with the huge super chat thank you so much uh have i considered playing just cause series uh if so i would suggest playing the third one regardless uh if you make it through the first two viewer wise they're much older games also best youtuber by far not just saying i really appreciate that rohan seriously thank you uh yeah uh i believe i have one of the just cause games already like i like it was gifted right to me is up now yeah i don't Almost know which one there. it is so i'd have to check I've just finished analyzing the latest security data you should find an indoor garden up ahead. A garden? Sounds fancy. A Japanese garden, to be precise. It is an area set aside for VIPs. Apparently, one of World Marshal's directors is a rather serious Japanese culture enthusiast. All right. So what's this got to do with me? Is there something I need from the garden? Not at all. You need only pass through that area to arrive at a freight elevator. I found a route to the elevator controls through the unit we hijacked downstairs. I have located the server room as well. You can reach it via the freight elevator. Great work, Doc. Elementary, my dear Raiden. Now, head for the garden. Damn. A cat th from the UK. 
Uh, first time ever catching you live in the UK. I'm 57 years old. Love your videos. Uh, your favorite. Uh, I appreciate you so much. Seriously, cat. I hope you're having a good day today. Dude, sir. The main exit is sealed. I very much doubt you can get through there. The catwalk above you is connected to a corridor meant for transporting materials. You can take that to the elevator. I wonder if we'll be actually we have a sneak pass. I don't, I don't think it's gonna work. Can't walk straight ahead to reach the elevator. Do I actually did it? My apologies, Raiden. I seem to have fallen behind. No worries. Actually, I should thank you. What are you talking about? If it wasn't for you, I wouldn't have gotten Jack back. Then, that is your true nature. More or less. Still interested? I find no reason to alter my objectives. From the moment we met, you have acted on emotional urges. You speak of protecting those weaker than you. Such people number in the billions. It is impossible. You cannot save every human being in the world. You cannot save every street child. After extended observation, I have come to a conclusion. 
Your actions are rooted in affinity for those from similar circumstances as yours. Huh. Guess so. Not much of a superhero after all, huh? However, your emotional status is understandable. Perhaps I share this same affinity. Well, if that's what you feel, then glad to have you along. Roger. You can reach the server room via the freight elevator just ahead. You know, the cardboard box actually worked, guys. Yeah, this know. way. The Ripper mode actually shreds, dude. Another freight platform! Look out! Incoming! <laughs> Oh, my God. 
Staffel reiten. The elevator cannot take much more as this. Jump to that adjacent platform. Oh, the, the platform is losing speed. Scheiße, the tripods are interfering. Reiten, clear them out of the shaft. Do not let them block the elevator. <laughs> God, this game is awesome, dude. Yeah, this game is awesome. They are deploying security from the top floor to the freight elevators. You pass to the server room leads right through them. Server rooms ahead? Yes, according <clears throat> to what I have here. What should I expect to find? If they're VR training those brains, I'm guessing it won't look like your typical IT department. Quite right. Most of it will likely be occupied by life support units. Feeding oxygen and nutrition to the brains they have stored, you know. They would also need a server to feed them the VR data, but in terms of structure, it's really more brain storage and maintenance than a server room. But no doubt it makes a convenient euphemism for what they are really doing there. Yeah, like how CIA agents refer to where they work as the company. Indeed. Something like that would never arouse the suspicions of rank-and-file staff who may hear it. And I'm sure those complicit in this operation feel better not calling it <laughs> the VR training room. Even something so simple as a name can help one ignore the truth of what they are doing. Truly fascinating how the human brain works. So this, whatever room, that's where Sundowner's waiting, right? If he wants a fight, I wish he'd just get on with it. He didn't seem the type to run and hide. Well, he is in charge of security, but I suspect this is not about business. If I had to guess, I would say he is toying with you, testing you, perhaps. Whatever he's doing, it won't change what's going to happen once I finally catch up with him. Mm. Is anybody else seeing lag? So my thing just said it's dream started lagging. Yeah, I mean, if you guys are just now responding to the lag comment, I said I asked that like a minute ago. <laughs> <laughs> I 
It's all good. Yeah, definitely. It was definitely lagging for whatever reason. Not exactly sure why. Uh, but it's all good. Um, uh, we'll actually just end it here uh, before we push any further into this. Because uh, I believe there's probably going to be a boss fight. And I'm not going to try to do that with potential lag hanging in the background. So uh, we'll end this one here, guys, for today. Uh, I'll be doing, I, I want to do at least two. I wanted to try to do two more streams today. We'll see how we are uh, time wise. Um, but I, I appreciate the love. I appreciate the support. Remember, if you guys do want to see the rest of this game, just smash that like button. Consider subscribing. Drop comments down below. Even after the stream's over and you guys are in live chat right now, uh, drop into the comment section. Let me know what you guys thought. And um, looks like it might have cleared up, but I feel like it might. Yeah, we'll, we'll leave it right here. It's all good. Uh, but I appreciate the love. I appreciate the support. And uh, if I don't see you guys later on, you have a great rest of your day. And uh, for everybody else, I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.